Coming to a different question, that is X and Y are partners sharing profits and losses in the ratio of 7 is to 3. They admit Z into partnership. Now students, in this case, Z share is not mentioned directly. What it further goes on to say is that X sacrifices 1 by 7th of his share and Y sacrifices 1 by 3rd of his share in favor of Z. We are required to calculate new ratio and the sacrificing ratio. Now students, it is clearly mentioned X sacrifices 1 by 7th of his share. Now to understand this concept, let us recall a small mathematical concept that we had done in 9th standard or 8th standard, that is board mass. The first alphabet that is B represents bracket, O represents off, that is English word off. Now we all know that in mathematical calculation, off means multiplication. So now students, let us calculate X's sacrifice. X's sacrifice is equal to 1 by 7th of his share. 1 by 7th of his share. His share is 7 by 10th. That means X is sacrificing 1 by 10th of his share in favor of Z. That brings us to X's new share. X's new share would be equal to old share minus sacrifice. The old share of X is 7 by 10 and the sacrifice of x is 1 by 10 that means the new share of x is the difference of these two which is 6 by 10. In similar manner we can calculate y's sacrifice. So y's sacrifice is equal to 1 by 3rd of his share 1 by 3rd into 3 by 10th again his sacrifice is 1 by 10th. So y's new share would be old share of y which is 3 by 10 minus sacrifice of y which is 1 by 10 which gives us 2 by 10 is the answer. So that means the new share of x is 6 by 10 and the new share of y is 2 by 10. Now students we have got the new share of x and y but z's share is not given to us. So a simple observation that is z's share would naturally be equal to the sacrifice made by x in his favor plus the sacrifice made by y in his share. So we can calculate z share as x's sacrifice plus y's sacrifice. The x's sacrifice was 1 by 10 and y's sacrifice was also 1 by 10. So that means z's share is 2 by 10. Now the new ratio would be x, y and z. For x it would be 6 by 10, for y it would be 2 by 10 and for z it would be again 2 by 10. 10 being the common denominator can be eliminated so ratio is 6 is to 2 is to 2. Again, 2 is the common factor in this ratio. You can cancel it out mutually and the new ratio would be 3 is to 1 is to 1. Now students, we are also required to calculate sacrificing ratio. We all know that sacrifice is equal to old share minus new share. So we can deduct the new shares out of the old ratio and get the sacrifice. But in this question, if we have a closer look, we had already calculated the sacrifices. That is, x's sacrifice was 1 by 10th and y's sacrifice was also 1 by 10th. That means, sacrificing ratio would be for x and y as 1 by 10 is to 1 by 10. 10 being the common denominator can be removed. So, the sacrificing ratio would be 1 is to 1. 